I, I felt uh, rather invulnerable. It always happens to other people. Mm. Everything, all bad thing happens to other people. And now this happened to me. I'm Rob Bayens, 41 years old. I have IVF and I have a SICD. As I'm a, a rather sporty guy and I never had any problems with my heart, uh, it came to me as a shock to hear about my uh, genetic disorder. At first I couldn't believe what was happening. For me the main concerns were on like, can I, can I sport again? Can I pick up my old life as I'm used to? Uh, will I be able to play with my children? Uh, will I be able to drive? my car again. So it was a mixture of practicalities, comfort and emotion. The most difficult part is that you don't know what to expect. I made my choice for the SICD. For me, uh, not touching the heart was very appealing. It suited me more with my lifestyle being sporty and being relatively young. On one hand, I was really afraid that my life would changed completely. Uh, on the other hand, I was very happy because now I knew that I was in danger and that there was a good solution for it. The procedure itself went uh, very quickly. I just stayed overnight and then went home. The only problem for me as a sporty guy was that I completely lost my stamina. Uh, and then I worked on my recovery. So. Uh, taking care of the wound and recovering and getting my stamina back again. I feel my SICD system almost always and I was really afraid that it would bother me and I would be very irritated by the system, especially when I felt the system at first and I saw it and thought well, this will be very uncomfortable. But now I still feel it but it's no discomfort. I don't consider myself as a patient because in normal life uh, I do the things I want to do. I have no restrictions. So the checkup is the only, way, uh, only time I realize that I'm a patient, although the checkup itself is very easy. My son uh, Timo, 10 years old, uh, when I recovered from the surgery, I noticed that he was afraid of hugging me. And I was wondering what's wrong with you, so I asked, Timo, why are you not hugging me again? And he was afraid of getting a, a shock while hugging me because I told him that this was an electrical device, that's, that I'm running on electricity now, so I'm really cool. So I'm the cool dad with an electrical device uh, inside him. I told him that uh, he shouldn't be afraid of that. And then the problem was clear because now he hugs me again. Well, sometimes I, I do realize that although I'm not always happy with it because I rather not need the device, I'm super lucky. I'm, I'm really fortunate that I have this device because I have a very dangerous disease, dysfunction, uh, which could cause death. And with this SCD, uh, I'm safe. I'm totally fine with it. Actually, I'm kind of proud that you really can see a scar because it's a part of me and then you can see there's something there. It sounds a bit strange maybe but I'm totally fine with it now. I'm Rob Bayens, 41 years old. I have IVF and I have a SICD.